Okay. I was able to find the right size uh, hexagonal wrench or the six uh, sides wrench and just turn this thing clockwise to loosen it. Once it's loosened and then as you can see um, it pops right out. Pops right out. So the fan just came out. The fan just came out. You know, so that's a um, six side uh, screw. It's a um, flocking screw. You know, so I was able to find the right feet. As you can see, this tool, six uh, sides. It has six sides. And it fits into that fixed uh, screw or set screw of the fan very nicely, very tight. And then all I did was just turn it clockwise and then it released the fan. And now I can pop the motor completely out of here. And be careful when you uh, separate this, make sure this green wire, which is the ground wire, um, you know, it's still attached. So there's a little bit of, oh yeah, there's also this, um, this uh, padding, padding here. You need to make sure this padding is not, um, you know, it's, the motor looks pretty new. I can't believe this motor is shot. You know, so I'm going to do some uh, testing to make sure this motor is not shot. Anyway, so that's what I'm doing right now. So I'm just going to untie this screw so I can disconnect the screen wire. Okay. Here we go. This uh, screw came out. And uh, now this green wire can be disconnected. Now I just need to buy this replacement motor um, and replace it. Okay, it's um, CF275. CF275. Or six U two five T V T L two point seven two hundred fifty uh twenty two hundred fifty or twenty five you know but this is this is the motor so you know and here this is even smaller, I can't read it. <laughs> anyway, so. Okay, so this is a CF275U25TL. Okay, and then 2.7F um, plus minus uh, 250 volts AC 5060 hertz uh, 25 to 70 degrees. Um, and then 0809 ROHS. So that's the motor. And then what do we here? What do we have here? We got here uh, all kinds of crazy stuff. It's flashing. It's very hard to read. Anyway, so this is the motor that we purchased. Right now.